Hello, my name is Peter Parfit, and today we're... Action to Total Machinery. Now, I think most people are aware of the path guide system that you use to create your bench tops with the perfect lineup of rows and columns which are absolute right angles. And that allows you to do 90 degree... 45, 45 degree, degree cuts. 45 degree cuts time and time again. Yeah. But once you've got a bench top like this, there are loads of other things you can do with yeah. it. Yeah, the bench you can have as an impromptu cutting station like we have now with trestles. You can take on sites, but you can also make a great uh, workshop bench with these gridder holes in your workshop, rock solid to whatever size you want, whatever material you want. It's just so useful. For example, you can use clamps like this, um, guide rail clamps, which go into the holes and we can clamp things to the bench. But like you have set up here, Peter, you're going to cut some birch ply, so dead square. Yeah, and actually uh, you can take the cutting a stage further. For example, at the moment we've just got the uh, ordinary uh, tall path. Tall dogs, they're 50 mil yeah, high. Yeah, so 50 you, can, mil high. you can cut up to 50 mil yep. um, in thickness with right. those. And you can use other dogs, like uh, the, the super dogs, which take it just a little bit taller. Yep. And the long super dogs, which allow you to cut much deeper material. Yeah. Uh, perhaps up to about 160 mil, I think. Yeah, I mean, most track saws have a capacity of 85 mil. Yeah. But you can do trenching, can't you? That's the beauty of it is you can now, do trench cuts. Trenching is really mm. important, particularly if you're trying to do some tenons like this, uh, because this cut here is the most important cut. Of yeah, all. that's the one you see. You know? That's the one you see, and that's the one you want at absolute right angles. So with your taller dogs, you can set this up to do that perfect cut there. The rest you can cut away in your normal manner, uh, but it's that cut which is absolutely yeah. precise. Now the beauty of the super dogs, whether it's the, the standard one or the long one, is that they can be used in four different ways. Yeah, exactly. It can be used, as this one is right now, with the chamfer piece there, which means that when you push it down into the bench top, it's going to stand perpendicular absolutely every time. And you just give it a twist to lock it, it locks, in place. Yeah, from the top. There. You can also put the 25mm boss on there, so yep. it looks like the original path, path dog. dog. So you can use them, if you already own um, Veritas uh, path uh, dogs, absolutely. you can use them with. Yep. You can uh, take away and have it as a plain dog, so you can set it at slight different Whatever heights. Whatever height you need. Uh, or you can put it from underneath the bench yep. and it'll then come up just a little bit. I mean, there's eight components in each of these, so oh, I know, it's a beautiful precisely, yeah, we Absolutely make ourselves lovely. very proud of that. But we can go beyond saw cutting. Yeah, not just an accessory for a track saw. Yep. These, these type of benches are great for clamping work too. Right, let me just show you one quick bit of work holding. I've put in a couple of tall dogs there. I've made these up myself and I call these path hats. You can make these up uh, at home if you wish. Yep. And uh, remember this piece of wood? We wanted to do some work on there. I can now put it between those two. And if I was machining here, drilling a hole, whatever it might be, I can push against there as yeah. hard as I like. And turn it round and I can do it on the other side as well. I can push wood against there. So having these simple things which you can make yourself, yeah. just a 20 millimeter hole all the way through, your dogs, whichever type you have, path dogs, path super dogs, yeah, and, and, and away you go. But there's other ways of holding work, aren't there? Yeah, I mean, we, we, together we came up with the concept of the cam and wedge set, didn't we, Peter? Yep. So this comprises of a pair of wedges, one cam clamp, backstop, and a spacer piece, and three pups. So, for example, if I want to hold something like this, we can use, we use our chamfering. If you notice, all these have got a 45 degree chamfer on. So that registers, I could just register the dog and makes it all low profile or sub flush. So we can pop that in there again. And of course, once you've chamfered the hole, it's chamfered forever. They're done, so exactly. Do yeah, again. yeah. Mm. Also protects the edges because they're not too sharp as well. So it just. Uh, uh, that you've just done there, people might not realise just how accurate this array of holes is. Yeah. That you can now put something on there which is going across the diagonal. Exactly, Peter. Perfect. This is CNC made. Yep. This is made by the path guide system. Yep. So that shows you how accurate yep. Absolutely. You know, cool. it all is. So if we want to hold something you know, large like this, this piece of maple, 
So we use our, um, our low profile pup. The uh, cam clamp goes on and then we use the, the wedge to take up any space. Just move that out. And then you've got the mechanical advantage. This has got a very slight cam on it. We use that mechanical advantage to lock that and in that's, place, that's, that is rock that's solid. That's rock solid, that's held on the bench perfectly. In fact, I yeah. could probably pick the whole bench up. Exactly, yeah. You know, nothing, no clamps in your way, it's all flush. So all you flush. Can, uh, pick up your plane? Yeah, for sure. And yeah. Do, do an operation on there on with no this, problem so at all. On this, so let's just shampoo off. Yeah, sure. This set you can buy exactly that as one set, which comprises of one backstop, a pair of wedges, one cam clamp, a space apiece, which you can use either way if you need it, and then there's three little pups. But then you can buy a pair of cam clamps, you can buy a pair of um, wedges, you can buy those in a pairs, and you, you can buy these individually. Yeah, so that's really useful because you might want to set things up so you can have several of these to yeah. maybe get things up square exactly. on the bench. Yeah, yeah. So you see we've got three sets of holes here, so you can use it at 45, but you can also use it at 90. And actually setting things up square reminds me of this product. Go on, talk me through this, Tim. Well, this is the, um, the Path Square made out of Alcomat. Again, CNC made, but we can use it on the bench. So with these holes here, let's pop that in there. Pop up in there. So then we can put this square on the bench. Again, this is made by CNC, but it fits onto this path guide made top perfectly, with no movement whatsoever. So we can use this as a reference. So it's positions onto the top using the, 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 the um, low profile pups. And we want to assemble this uh, frame up so we can use the small pups. And then we've got the, the cam clamps. And then we'll use these spacer pieces. Lock that in and on this side as well. And if you had to put these in a different position because your wood was thicker, then you could use the wedges like we did before. Exactly, to yeah. take up any, any yeah. distance to yeah. get you to the, to the next hole. Yeah. We know that square. I don't need to get my square out to check it. So if you want to fix that up with a pocket hole or screw, wait for the glue to go off. Now that is really useful. It's whilst you wait for glue to go off. Because yeah. there's so many times you, you, you've got something brought together yeah. and then the, as the glue goes off, it's not staying square. But, exactly, yeah. yeah. Guaranteed. So we're yeah. taking advantage of this yeah. accurately made top. But there's also another way you can hold it square. If you didn't have these, you could put a clamp across between the two sides. Sure, well. exactly. Yeah. And if we had another assembly square, we could put that on top here, go on the inside. Yep. And with simple clamps like this, we yep. could clamp that up. And I've actually used the one I've got for that exact Just that purpose. way. Yeah, Absolutely. exactly. So they, they yeah. work really well yeah. to get it as really, a pair really as well. And it's interesting just how tough this Velcromat material yeah, is. Yeah, it's really good it's, stuff, it's isn't it? It's not MDF. This is almost engineering sort of straight. Yeah. Yeah, it's a very, very yeah, strong much material. Denser, much, much denser, much denser. And I'm, I've got another little demo here of just how accurate this original top is produced with the Path Guide system. You put those two dogs in there. Yeah. I've got a, a long dog here and there's a hole there. Now, I wonder if that... Look at that. It's amazing. Isn't that... That's CNC made. Yep. That's made of the Path Guide yep. system. I know. I know. Now, one of the great things about a bench like this is, of course, you can make it with the pattern holes exactly how you want it to be. Exactly. It yeah. could be that you're replacing your MFT3 top. Yeah. I've done that a few times. Different material, if you Different like. Different materials, yeah. Yep. Uh, it could be you're building your custom workbench for the workshop. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and there's another thing which people are not aware of. Now, you sell these clamps. Yeah. Now, uh, you put the end through there, and then you bring your workpiece up, and then that Watch now that. is locked solid. So if we were having to do a bit of work here, maybe with a router or something, that's going to be held yeah. beautifully. But you don't need the top to be that complicated. You don't no, need to do all the holes, do you? No, absolutely right. If you're working on site uh, and you suddenly yeah. arrive one day and, and your boss says, right, I've got 200 feet of flooring, you've got to cut it all into pieces at right angles, Yeah. Uh, go and grab a piece of the flooring, go and grab a piece of MDF, and all you need to do is to put about six holes in yep. it. Yeah, square. Two for the tall ones, yeah. and a couple along there, 
and you can then put your guide rail against the tall dogs and cut all that flooring at perfect square, right angles. On site. On site. Yeah, with no with problem. With trestles. It takes about 15 minutes to produce the top. About light six there. holes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Now, the Path Guys system tolerances are really tight. They're engineering quality, they're engineering tolerances for the woodworker. And that means that sometimes when you put your dogs in, they're going to be a little bit tight. And it's okay pushing them in, but sometimes getting them out can be a nuisance. Well, you can make something like this. Cut a 20 millimetre hole there, split it here, and then you've got the ideal little clamp for pulling a difficult dog out. Well, I think, Tim, we've now really shown people the current range of UJK PATH products. And it all stems from the PATH guide system, which all you need is a drill and the PATH guide system, and you can produce your perfect bench top with those rows and columns at perfect right angles. Exactly. And from that, all the engineering accuracy in woodwork comes into play. Into play. And you can take this on site, so you've got the accuracy on site where you need it. And it all saves workshop. you space as well. Exactly. In workshop, you've got a, a much more compact area where you're working and you know you don't need that big panel saw anymore. It's true, yeah, exactly. It's going to ruin your panel saw sales, <laughs> <Yeah, I know. laughs> <laughs> That's very true. But yeah, exactly, you can put this on the wall, out the way, take it outside, or make different, different kits, different tops, as and when you need them. Yeah. And we're very proud of the fact that the majority of this kit is made here in Axminster and it's being exported yeah, all over the world. And that's a great thing for UK PLC. Definitely. So I do hope you found this useful. Thank you for watching. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Take care. Bye-bye. Cheers. Bye.